Good evening everybody and um, welcome to a super quick video. This isn't going to be um, one of the longer videos out there. I'm just going to do a quick what sold video. I just wanted to do it live because then I don't have to worry about uploading slash editing it. So I'm going to get straight to it. Um, these are going to be 10 cool items that we've sold in the past week. We've tried to keep it as non-RC as possible. There is actually only one radio control part in this haul, uh, sorry, in this sales video. So hopefully they won't be too too much of an issue. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to the um, screen share view and we'll get on with some items. Um, the very first item I want to share with you guys that um, we sold, um, it's a pretty nice sale, I actually just sold today. Um, it's a Sony A-Track CD Walkman belt carry um, case slash pouch. Um, I actually paid more than I would have normally paid for this item at a car boot. I think I paid £1.50. Normally at a car boot you'd expect to pay a pound or 50 pence for any kind of a case pouch type item um, but this one was £1.50 however I thought it was still worth it. Um, you can see it's got the Sony and the Walkman branding on it, the newer Walkman branding. This is the branding that they had near the end of like the old school CD players um, type thing so um, there you go you can see that it's there it's made for a CD player I've got the kind of little normal latch on the back um, it, it hasn't taken a long time to sell but it hasn't been super quick I think it's probably taken about a month maybe to sell um, it this can't have been that long because we've only just started uh, sourcing again so I'm, I don't think it would have taken that long um, so it's actually a pretty good sale as you can see so you can see we sold it for £17.99 um, plus £2.99 shipping so not bad at all it'll go as a large letter via Royal Mail and um, no worries there at all. So that was the first item um, I sold. So um, let me just uh, move on to the next item. Um, the next item we sold was uh, this brother. Let me just go back to screen share. This brother knitting machine card punch. Now, um, as some of you guys know, a couple of weeks back, Rebecca picked up a a, a really brilliant um, knitting machine lot. Um, we paid five pounds. Well, she paid five pounds for this item. Um, this this lot. It was a knitting machine, and it came with some accessories. Um, the knitting machine is actually in this sales video because obviously we sold it within the last week but this is this is just the a card punch that was bundled in with it um, so it's a brother knitting machine card punch you can see brother card punch with built-in safety lock pretty retro looking item um, the box has got the instructions printed straight on it and um, the model number etc is on the side um, of the item so pretty nice looking item um, and it was on sale again for it's got can't be more than two weeks uh, but it must be over two weeks because it seems to have a 10% off on it so it means it must have just gone over two weeks um, and um, it sold um, I was asking 17.99 instead I got 16 pounds 19 plus shipping and it's on its way to Russia so fantastic sale I'm really really pleased with that sale um, and Beck is is chuffed with that as well it's turned out to be a really good haul. Um, hi to everyone in the chat quickly I'll say hi to Corey, Chris, Catherine, uh, Karen, Ash, uh, very personal skits, Darren, Smart, um, World Wonders, hi everybody. Like I said guys, MMAS, hi there guys. I'm going to just be rattling through this because I just wanted to make a sales video and, and I, I decided to do it live. I don't have to edit it or upload it. This happens all in one go. So a bit of a selfish reason on my half. So I do apologize if I don't interact with you guys in the chat for as much. But this is hopefully going to be more of a, um, this is going to be more of a, like a, a sales, what sold video type thing. So, you know, hopefully you guys will um, see some cool items that you like and, and we can take it from there, right? Um, right, we're going to go on to the next item. This is pretty cool. This is a young scientist chemistry set. Again, only picked this up within the last week or two, I think. I think it was two weeks ago, actually. Um, we went to a very small tabletop sale. Um, it didn't look that brilliant, actually. It looked a bit mm, iffy. However, this was one of the items that we picked up. Um, I actually only picked up a couple of items from there, and they've both sold, which is really cool. But we paid £5 for this. This is a Young Scientist Chemistry 100 set. We paid £5 for this. Brand new and sealed, bear in mind. Um, made in the UK by Salter. Uh, really nice little item. Like I said, it only took a couple of weeks in the end to sell. We got full asking price of £30 plus £6.99 shipping. 
Um, shipping could have been a little cheaper had it been a little shorter in length but because it was over 45 centimeters in length you can't send it via Royal Mail small parcel anything above 45 centimeters and above 16 centimeters in depth automatically so you know either if your item is like over 45 centimeters it has to go as a medium or if even if it's under 45 but the depth is more than 16 centimeters again it has to go as a medium parcel so we charged a bit extra for shipping but that's cool so that was the next item all right moving on um okay is that a mega hall in the back says welsh wonders it, it is a hall um yes it is a hall um it's a, we'll, we'll maybe share some of it with you guys in tomorrow's chat maybe um but yeah i'm i'm kind of like you know i don't want to kind of um inspo from my upload today says corey um you put out a sales video as well i'm gonna check it out corey yes of course you inspire me you're an inspirational uh young dude definitely um Zahir, need help with my webcam. Any way to contact us, Karen? I'll be more than happy to help you with that, Karen. Um, what's the best way to contact me? Um, either on... Oh, I don't know if you do WhatsApp or not, but if not, we you can just message me on YouTube and I can reply. Um, or we can then do WhatsApp or something, but off the top of my head, that's all I can think of. WhatsApp's probably the best thing. Um, right. Let's move on to the next item, guys. And hello to everyone else that's joined. I can see treasure pirate as well um paul calvert says is that retail arbitrage you got there no paul it's a, a haul i picked up of more stuff um which we'll share with you but yes karen a whatsapp is probably going to be the best thing and we can sort it out no worries smoke signal says karen very funny darren very funny very funny i appreciate the comment though <laughs> smoke signals um moving on guys the good old Olympus Mew camera. Again, I shared this just in the last week or so. Uh, um, this is an Olympus Mew uh, Zoom 140. The Zoom is not the most sought after camera. Um, you can see I took some photos of it with the battery in, etc. Well, actually, they're rip terrible. The photos. A bit. Look at that. Hold on. Let me change. Okay, that's in that's in focus. But that. Okay, that. That's a terrible photo. I can't believe that was my main photo. I can't believe I let that slip past. Can you see how blurry that is, guys? I don't know what the camera has focused on, but not enough. Um, that's a much more sharper photo. Anyway, um, bought this camera for a pound. Um, I believe I accepted an offer on this camera of 28. I could have probably held out for more, but 28 plus shipping from a pound, I was happy just to quickly churn it over the stuff that i'm picking up from car boots and, and charity shops i'm pretty aggressive with the pricing i'm not bothered about holding out for the top top money um so yeah sometimes it just comes in and i'm just gonna like take you know take an offer if i'm happy with the offer um so that's how i see it um, moving on to the next item guys um, next item is also going to be an item that we shared from the tabletop sale um, a couple of weeks back and that is this Roberts radio now I'm pretty happy with this sale I did pay two pounds for this radio which considering its condition is about as much as I would want to pay it's a Roberts R9924 three band pocket radio portable radio whatever you want to call it and overall its condition it could have been a lot better um, it had some really terrible kind of staining on the back. You can see that around the battery compartment where something corrosive or something that damages the plastic has been spilled all over it um, and somehow it's still working. But yeah, you can see it's horrific condition there and it did have some severe corrosion to the terminals. However, it still worked. So um, I actually sold that for $14.99 plus shipping. So pretty happy with that sale. Um, cannot complain with that one at all um quickly pop into the chat not for too long um well your photos are great z seriously see mine says karen oh thank you karen appreciate that um you might have to gear up the pigeon says death by glamour very funny <laughs> um you know where to get the deals now guys get your offers in says ash i don't know what you're talking about um <laughs> you know, shazad says hi um Right, lots of boxes going to Amazon FBA or Merchant, I'm guessing Merchant. Sean, they're not going on um, Amazon at all. Um, Sean, they're not Amazon at all. It, um, 
Question, have you tried the multi-buy option for your RC parts? Not yet, Shazad. I will do. I will do. Um, I was literally going to do it today, but I got sidetracked with listing. Got so much work to do. There's a lot of stuff um, to be getting on with. Um, so, yeah. And, and, and look, I'm here making the video instead. <laughs> Talk about procrastination. Moving on to the next item quickly, guys. We're on to... Um, this is something that I'm really happy with. This is a lovely sale. This is a Dunlop Biomimetic Pro carbon framed squash racket. Um, I didn't actually put squash or racket in the title, which I've just noticed. Wow, that's really good. Luckily, it was in the squash racket category. Um, and this really did not take a long time to sell. This um, this racket, this squash racket, I paid 50 pence for. Um, 50 pence is not much money. It's carbon frame. I got it from a charity shop, actually. Um, I got all the information just from that part there pretty much like what what, what it's about um, and I accepted an offer of 31 pounds plus 15 pounds shipping and it's gone to Germany so really good sell from 50 pence um, you'll notice that a lot of charity shops um, will have um, tennis rackets and squash rackets most of them are not going to be worth money but if something's made out of like carbon fiber, it's always worth checking it over. Um, I really didn't think Dunlop would be a good brand. Dunlop isn't in my mind what I consider to be a good brand. Um, so I was really surprised to see that Dunlop um, fetched such good money. Um, so I, you know, I just, I was surprised, but yeah, really good. So if you see something with, made out of carbon fiber, um, you know, something like light, it's well worth, um, well worth picking up and um you know it's it's just good good to do that um and from 50 pence yeah really can't complain um welsh wonder says squash is a license to print money z great pickup thank you um and um Shazad says my best starts of the month so far on ebay 13 grand well done Shazad. i don't know what else to say that's insane um moving on this is an item we have had for an absolute age um, this was actually a pickup we had as part of the haul from the house clearance, believe it or not. We've had it for ages. We've listed it at a very high price. It was a red wool gold tone Machino peace sign key ring. Now this is just made out of probably some regular metal. There was nothing special about this apart from the fact that it's Machino and the fact that it's made in Italy. So it has the brand behind it basically. You know, red wool and it's a machine no keyring so designer keyring it's not out of any precious metal at all no part of it was precious metal um so we we put it up though for 60 pounds because there's i think we saw a completed of a different design which fetched some good money but it may have been that the other design was just more desirable than this design this piece design it hung around for ages we actually got an offer a couple of a week back for 30 pounds which we accepted um, but then the customer didn't pay um, and I opened a case the case closed against the customer um, and the customer actually got back and said I'm new to eBay I'm really sorry I didn't pay um, you know I'd still like to buy it at the price if you'd be willing to sell it to me again um, and because their feedback was low and because I had opened a case and it had closed against them so hopefully they've learned a lesson I, I gave them another chance and this time they did pay um, and we shipped it off so we we didn't get what we wanted but £30 which we're pretty happy with in the end because it, you know it's all profit for the for this item really um so you know and we've had it for such a while it made sense to finally move it along so 30 pounds for that one um pretty happy with that um moving on to the next item this is something we've already shared with you but we had to i had to share it because it's such a fantastic sale um Earlier on in this sales video, we showed you the um, card punch that we sold out of the £5 pickup um, that Beck made at the car boot. Um, and she bought for £5 a knitting machine, a bunch of stuff, which included that card punch machine. And here is the knitting machine itself. We sold it for a hundred and I think it was £74 plus like £50 shipping. A lot of profit there for us. Uh, Beck tested it out there, got it running. Um, and when I say running, it's a mechanical machine, but she tested it out, made sure all the pins were fine. There was no nothing bent, nothing in the way of the carriage sliding across. So really, really happy with this. I won't dwell on it too much, but 
that's probably our best sale of the week by a country mile so it was only right for me to 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 share that one with you as i'm sure you guys will appreciate i was, I was so chuffed for bex so already we've had that sale out of it and now we've had the whole punch out of it um which is fantastic um hi lisa how are you guys just to let you know i'm sorry if i've not been um going into the chat and talking to you guys as much i am just um going through and making uh just doing a sales video i thought i'd do it live because then i don't have to upload or edit so a bit of selfish reasoning um to go live um so i do apologize if you guys um i'm not giving you guys the normal amount of attention in the chat um so i'm just gonna carry on we're down to the last couple of items um so hopefully it won't be too much longer N the next item this is another car boot pickup I believe it is a car boot pickup. I can't remember. Yes, it is. It's a car boot pickup. I paid two pounds for it. I just remembered. You, it's really funny. You can sometimes remember the actual scenario where you pick something up. So I actually remember now buying it. And that's where the price came into my head. It was two pounds. Um, I got it from a guy that I normally buy a few bits and pieces from. He does like house clearances. Um, he only asked for two quid for it. Or I think he actually asked three and I said two. And he was like, mm, go on then. Um, and it's an Olympus Mu 1. So we're getting closer to the holy grail of the Mu 2, but it's just a Mu 1. Um, still a very popular camera, um, highly desirable camera. It didn't take long to sell at all. I think on the day I listed it, I got an offer for £50 and I was more than happy to take £50 for it. It's a fixed zoom camera. So, it's not, you know, that means it's, uh, you know, the fixed zoom cameras tend to have a better lens quality on them. Uh, like if you have an SLR camera, prime lenses, which don't have a zoom on them, tend to be better quality in terms of the lens and so in terms of the colors and they produce just, just better quality glass used uh, rather than the zoom lens. You have to spend loads of money to get good quality zoom lenses but yeah this is a 59.99 camera offered 50 pounds um and it's plus 15 pounds shipping and it's on its way to thailand um so hopefully it will have gotten there by now if it hasn't then i'm sure it'll get there soon so really happy for from two pounds to 50 pounds sale so moving finally on guys to the final item i really appreciate everyone popping in and always appreciate um um you know all the comments in the chat and and everything so final item i had to go to an rc part because believe it or not out of all the sales this week those nine were the non-rc sales that we had everything else we sold and we had some really nice juicy sales um was all rc this is just one of the rc parts it's not even the best sale we actually had a sale where a guy bought two engine mounts for like 60 quid but this is a pretty nice sale this is some carbon fiber tail and fin set for a, a an rc helicopter so yeah carbon tail fin set made of carbon fiber had it for a while listed for ages you know not much to say sold it for 20 pounds um but i wanted to round it up to 10 sales so that's what i did so thank you everybody to join me um Thank you, everybody who's joined me in this uh, live stream. I'm not going to keep you much longer. I've got things to do. I'm sure you guys have got things to do as well. Um, and I hope you enjoyed the 10 cells. If you had a favorite, it'd be cool if you just put it down in the comment section. Leave a thumbs up on the video. You know, all that good stuff. I really appreciate it. Um, so thanks, everybody, for popping in. And I will see you guys um, in the next video, which will be tomorrow, which will be live stream with me and Beck. So bye, guys. Thanks.